Hi everybody, it's Crystal. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's doing well and staying safe. So welcome to my channel, Bag of Day Crochet, where we talk about all things yarn and crochet. So if you don't, well, if you like to crochet, I got hundreds of tutorials and I put on <laughs> loads more. But if you don't crochet, I got lots of yarn content. I try to keep everybody updated on the new yarns and new yarn stores, old yarns and just yarn in general. I love it. You love yarn. This is the place for you. All right. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that like button on this video. And let's check out what I have for you today. So I have a new yarn. Uh, today is uh, 6 uh, 26 2021. And Lion Brand's going through a. Um, they're getting new yarns. Um, yarn companies get new yarns, you know. They'll get winter yarns in and then they'll get summer, yarn, summer yarns in at certain types of year. Certain times of the year. Well, uh, lately Lion Brand's been pushing out some new yarns. And I have um, opened, unboxed all of them so far <laughs> that I have seen. And um, they had this new one, and I, I wanted it so bad. Um, and it it's not available as of today on their website. I only found it online. That this is me online at Joann's and online at Walmart. Walmart had none available except for one color, and then Joann's finally they had it on there, but it wasn't available for a long time. Finally, they made it all available except for two colors. So I have all the colors here except for two colors. Believe it or not, the two colors that weren't available were my two favorite colors. Like a mustard color and a brown color. But we'll go over the colors that we have here. I am super excited to get it, actually. Out of all um, Lion Brand's new yarns, this was the one I was most excited about. And it's Big Brother, which is the same only it's a bulky which I have it reviewed it used it and made a blanket I have a tutorial on that too you should check it out I also have a tutorial on that uh, poncho top back there um, I just put that on too in case you're interested all right let's get let's look at the yarn. super super excited about it I mean there's lots of many reasons I'm excited about this but one thing I think the color palette that they chose for the yarn was out of the park um beautiful beautiful color palettes that they uh chose and another thing is it's a recycled yarn and i like the way this isn't the first recycled yarn that lion brand like i said has put out um yeah okay so they're all solid colors it's called a Lion Brand Respun 100% Recycled Polyester Bonus Bundle. Reduce, reuse. This yarn is made from recycled plastic, keeping bottles and other waste out of our oceans and landfills. Now, for those of you that say, I'm not using yarn that's made out of plastic. If you use acrylic or polyester, you may you're using plastic. That's what it's made from. You got acrylic clothing you bought from the store or polyester clothing or anything like that it's made man-made from plastic so it's nothing new you use red heart super saver it's man-made from plastic and and other things but i'm just saying lion brand it just took it a step further and and they're using recycled plastic to make theirs which is very very good um, I done a review on a recycled yarn before and people are like, I'm not in no way I'm wearing plastic around my neck. I thought acrylic and polyester is plastic. What are you talking about? That's what it is. So it's nothing, there's nothing wrong with it. That's just how it's made. It's a man-made fiber. So um, let's look at it. So here's the label. Nice, very recycled look to it. You know, it's a brown paper. Love it. Love it. Okay, so let's see. It says it's 10 ounces, 284 grams, 658 yards, or 602 meters. Machine wash on gentle, and you can tumble dry. That's always nice, right? A medium weight number four is what this is classified as. Um, knitting needle recommendation is a five millimeter, and a crochet hook is a six right on. That's what I would recommend myself. If I was using this, which I'm going to use after this video, I'm going to make something with it in the other room while I watch movies with my children. And I am going to be using a six millimeter hook. <laughs> All right. It says um, 
it meets the global recycled standard. Um, made in India. The color I have here is called Blush. Very, very pretty. Okay, so what does a recycled polyester uh, feel like? Well, it feels fine. It smells clean. It smells like a cardboard box because that's what it came in. Joann's always ships in these huge, huge boxes and it's such a waste. I hate that. But I, I recycle the boxes for giveaways. So I guess when they're big, that's good for a good big giveaway. But anyways, um, yeah, it's nice, clean smell and yarn. Okay, so it feels fine. I would definitely make a scarf out of it. In fact, what I'm making is something wearable. So, um, yes, it's nice. Um, you know, but you have to remember it is a recycled yarn. I think it's so pretty. Now let's talk about the yardage and the price because I don't know if you've noticed, I've bought a lot of recycled, or not just me. I mean, there's just a lot of, there's been lots of recycled yarns on the market. And sometimes the recycled yarns can be a bit pricey because of the process that, that they have to go through. Now, this being a 100% re recycled yarn, I think the price point is spot on and I think it's worth every penny. And for them to even ask more for it would not even be out of line. I would probably pay a little bit more for it. I mean, I think they did really good on the price point of this. So it runs $7.99 at Joann's. Um, $7.97 at Walmart when they get the colors in um, and then at Joann's I actually had 20 they had a sale 20% off I, or I think it was 20 I don't know they had a sale I got this for $5.99 a ball and that is for 658 yards of recycled yarn I think that's a steal for $5.99 but even at their regular price of $7.99 is perfect I mean it's an excellent price point if you ask me like I said I would pay even more for a, a nice recycled yarn and their color palette is amazing so I'm going to show you the colors first this is like I told you the blush I have all of them but two unfortunately I cannot find them anywhere and it's my two favorite ones that they have <clears throat> hopefully hopefully Joann's will get them in or Walmart one of the few because that's the only places I can find them if you guys see them anywhere else let me know I don't go to my Joann store because it's small and it sucks and it's really far away. But uh, it does. It says it's not even available in my Joann's anyways. Okay, so this one is called Raven. Very beautiful black uh, charcoal. I guess you could call it charcoal. Mm -hmm. I did would just say black, but a lot of people would say charcoal. So, you know, that's very, very pretty. Mm hmm. Uh-huh. This one's very pretty. I'm smelling each one. Cardboard. Clean cardboard. <laughs> Clean cardboard. Okay, so this one we have is called uh, Parchment. Very pretty. Very neutral. Very appropriate name. Um, I like that one a lot. I like neutral colors. Hmm. It feels really nice it does i mean it does for recycled yarn some of them could be a bit iffy but i had purchased their big brother of this and it was i i knew i mean i use it like i said already i like it a lot and i knew that i was gonna like this and i was super excited to get the four weight in it um this one is called silver so yes very very pretty neutral again nice it's a nice gray you know it being recycled it almost has that heathered look to it it does i mean it has a heather look to it you can see that in it so it's very very hmm. i like this one a lot i think this one's really pretty this one is called amber hmm. beautiful but i like those colors i like the burnt oranges and and stuff rusty colors it's very very pretty We got a raisin. So this is, uh, I thought this would be blue when I saw it on the internet. I, I don't think I even looked at the names, but uh, it looked blue. But now you can tell it looks exactly like a raisin. You can see the purple in it. 
It's like a purplish blue, I guess. It does look like a raisin. <laughs> I like that one too. It's very nice. Mm hmm. Clean. Clean. That's all we asked for, right? Clean yarn. Clean yarn. Okay. I already showed you that one. Let's see. We got this one right here. It's called Hazelwood. Very pretty uh, neutral. I love these. I love these a lot. I do. Ooh, this one's really pretty. How many colors I got? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve colors. So I have all but two because I can't find them. I can't find them. I need them so bad. Um, this is very beautiful. Alpine. Ooh, I like that. I can't decide really which, which color I want to use on the project that I'm getting ready to make. This could be a winner. Very pretty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have two more to show you. Where are you at? Here's one. This one's pretty too. Deep denim. So that is very, very denim looking. Very blue jean looking. I like that one a lot. Yeah. Okay. One more color I got in here, I guess. I don't see it. How could I not see that? It was right on top. <laughs> Another very pretty one. This one is called Wine. I love the look of it. I really, really like it a lot. Is it going to crochet well? Well, we can give it a go and test it out real quick. I'll do a little swatch of it. Um, I did notice one thing about it. It appears to be a little bit of a light, lighter for yarn. Um, but that's only my, well, maybe not. You guys can be the judge. I thought it was a little light, but... You can judge that. That that's it's a four, but maybe a little on the light side, maybe not. But it's still doable for me. I'm excited to use it. I'm gonna crochet up a little swatch, and we're gonna see what it looks like. So the two colors that I'm missing that they do not have for sale anywhere that I can find it. If you guys find it, let me know in the comments because I really really want them. It is one called corn silk. It's like a mustard color. I love that color. It's gorgeous. And then the other one is called um, Cider. It's like a brown, like a darker brown. And I really, <laughs> brown's my favorite color. So I gotta have it. So if you guys happen to see roll, roll up on these anywhere, please let me know in the comments where I can buy them. I know Joanne sells them, but right now they're out or something. They just don't have them. So, but if, well, they don't have them online at the moment, at the making of this video. But yeah, if you guys see them, let me know. I have to have them. I have to. Okay, I'm doing a little crocheting with it, and I do have the six millimeter hook as per recommendation. And you can see I am using a darker color. I apologize. I guess I should have chose a lighter one. I'm not having any trouble crocheting with it at all. It's not uh, giving me any any problems. I'm going to stick with my uh, initial statement when I said that it is a bit um, on the lighter side of a four. <clears throat> but other than that, you can just see it crochets just fine. I'm not having any trouble with it really with it splitting on me. Um, I think maybe it split one time, but that could just spin uh, me. So being excited and in a hurry. So you can see when I flip it over. So this will work very well if you want to use a stitch like bobbles or puffs or cables the stitch definition is going to show up unfortunately me choosing the start color right now is wasn't a good choice but you will be able to see it regardless dark or light you could see it's there the bobbles are nice it crochets fine it feels good i like it let me turn it around and give you my initial thoughts on this okay so i like the yarn and I applaud Lion Brand for, you know, doing their part in trying to make some recycled yarns. I think that's awesome. I do like it, and I like it a lot. And I also like its bigger brother, which is the same, but you can find that on LionBrand.com and buy it. And they have a lot of beautiful colors that are different than the colors that the four weight comes in. Um, like I said, I bought it, reviewed it, and I made a blanket out of it. I loved it. It's a beautiful yarn as this is. Now I usually like to rate these yarns um, on different factors. So 
I'm going to go first with the color palette that they made for this is outstanding. I like it that they kept it all solids. Me personally, that's me. But even if they did come out with variegated, um, it would be cool if they could come out with ones that matched or striped. Um, I'm not much of a variegated person, but if they came out with stripes that match, that'd be cool, or even variegated, whatever. But as for the solid uh, palette that they have now, they're all very, very beautiful. Um, I can't wait to get the other two. Um, I think that it being, being a recycled yarn, you have to remember it's recycled, so it will feel a bit different, but it feels good for being a recycled yarn. And... I think also for it being a recycled yarn, their price point is more than generous um, compared to other yarns that I've seen that have been made from recycled yarns. For the amount of yardage you get here, um, 660 yards almost, at a regular price of $7.99 is great, but you can always get it on sale. Like I got, I pay $5.99 for this and I think that's a killer deal. I pay that all day long. I'd pay $7.99 all day long and I wouldn't even flinch because I think that is worth every penny of that. Um, I think I like it a lot of their respun. You know, they've come out recycled yarns before, but of all their recycled yarns, the respun so far is my favorite. So I think this one, four weight of it, and the five weight of it, are my favorite yarns that they've come out with this year so far. Um, so if I had to rate this on a scale of one to 10, 10 being the best, and no yarns ever got a 10 from me, but <laughs> and one being not so good, I take all that I just said into consideration. And I think it's a solid for me. Now remember, these are only my personal opinions. I bought this yarn. I don't, I'm not affiliated. I don't care if you buy the yarn or not. I'm just trying to tell you my honest opinions. And I always recommend that you just buy one ball because just because I like it a lot does not mean that you will. Um, some people may not like the feel of a recycled yarn. Me, I, you know, I know what that, you know, they're a bit different, but they don't feel bad. So I'm going to give it a solid. 9.5 yes you heard it rago day gave a 9.5 i love this yarn it's very very nice and i think lion brand hit it out of the park with these two uh reese buns the four weight and the five weight i can't wait to get the other two colors so that's it guys the only thing that marked it down for me was the fact that i think their four weight is a little bit on the thin side if it was a little thicker Maybe, just maybe, I would have gave it a 10. I don't know, I doubt it though. But it still did pretty, it still did pretty good. Um, I love it a lot. So thanks everybody for watching. Remember, my personal opinions, they can be different than yours. I only buy one at first, because you might not like it. What I love, you might hate. I love lots of yarns that lots of people hate. It's only each, everybody's personal preferences are different. And I would hate to tell you that, you know, I love it, which I do. I do love it. I like, I like a lot. I'm going to go make something with it right now. Um, for you to buy a whole bunch and then you not like it. So just buy one. Just see if you like it just to make sure. But that's it. Thanks everybody for watching. Remember, drop it in a comment box. If you see those other two colors, that yellow one and that dark brown. I need those available that I can purchase online. I need them to complete my collection. Okay. Lion Brand, if you're watching... Excellent. Excellent job on that. I applaud you again for your beautiful yarn you just put out. And um, that's it. So everybody, as always, I'll see you on my next video, which I'm sure will be soon. And I'll look for the tutorial of what I make out of that. Check the tutorial out, which I've made out of the Respun. It's a Chevron blanket. It's on my channel. And I will see you soon, okay? Stay safe, everybody. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.